The way of the cross is a means to understand and feel one with the mammoth suffering of our Lord Jesus. Through a series of 14 stations, we try to journey with Jesus and connect the different facets which might trouble us at various walks of life. The way of the cross, if contemplated fervently, helps us to feel Christ walking with us, providing consolation and strength. Let us pray. Lord Jesus, we offer our hearts to you while journeying with you to Calvary today. May we become more receptive of your love for us. May each station address me personally, piercing my heart with the Holy Spirit. Let me be born again with you and in you. Amen. First station, Jesus is condemned to death. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. The chief priests and the scribes bound Jesus and delivered him to Pilate. All of them condemned him, saying, He deserves to die. He is accused of inciting rebellion, but Jesus doesn't resist. He doesn't fight back. He accepts what is about to happen. He surrenders. Pilate knows Jesus is innocent. Still, he does not oppose his death sentence. Jesus is ready to take upon himself the guilt and the shame. Prayer Jesus, strengthen me when I am being condemned for doing good where wrong has been done. Give me the courage to stand for what is good and just. Help me to create a heart that is loving and grateful, that I may never take granted your endless love for me. Have mercy on us, O Lord, have mercy on us. Holy Mother, pierce me through. In my heart each wound renew of my Saviour crucified. Second station, Jesus carries his cross. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Jesus has already suffered 
enough pain after he was condemned lashes kicks knuckles and much more the crown would have been a disaster and now he begins his long journey to calvary where death awaits him many are doubting would he even reach calvary the journey has just begun prayer Jesus often we take up our crosses and begin our journeys which consist of pain trials and tribulations sometimes we ourselves doubt if we would ever make it to the end since the cross weighs down our shoulders and we get weary and disheartened at these very moments help us to remember your unfailing love and sacrifice for us and may we obtain strength from it have mercy on us o lord have mercy on us holy mother pierce me through in my heart each wound renew of my savior crucified third station Jesus falls for the first time we adore you o christ and we bless you because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world the weight is unbearable the taunts of the crowd ringing in his ears he lies on the ground soaked in blood deprived of strength struggling to his feet he painfully resumes the journey Prayer. Jesus you stumble and fall and find the inner strength to rise again Lord through your example may our weaknesses make us stronger and more accepting of the weaknesses of others show us how to resume life's journey with assurance and hope 
Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. Holy Mother, pierce me through. In my heart, each wound renew. Of my Savior crucified. Fourth Station Jesus Meets His Mother We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. There is something special in this woman Mary. Jesus is in great distress, but meeting her has filled him with great strength. She pleaded to the officials to have mercy on her son, but they never listened. This is not the kind of an encounter which any son would like to have with his mother. They share a bond, a very special bond. Prayer. Lord Jesus, it would have been very painful for Mother Mary to see you go through such excruciating pain. But nevertheless, she knew this had to happen. Meeting Mother Mary filled you with strength. Likewise, help us to find strength too, not only in our own mothers but in our families as well. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. Holy Mother, pierce me through. In my heart, each wound renew of my Savior crucified. Fifth Station Simon of Cyre helps Jesus carry the cross. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. The soldiers are becoming impatient. This is taking longer than they wanted it to. They come upon a man of Cyrene. Simon by name. They compel this man to carry the cross. Simon does not choose. He receives an order. Journeying along, the Cyrenian realizes that it is a grace to be able to accompany Jesus on his way to crucifixion.
prayer lord just as you opened the eyes and heart of simon of cyrene by his share in your cross help us to aid our neighbors indeed help us to realize that it is a grace to be able to share the cross of others have mercy on us o lord have mercy on us holy mother pierce me through in my heart each wound renew of my savior crucified Sixth station. Veronica wipes the face of Jesus. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Many people have joined in to reach Calvary. Some are excited to see three men being nailed on the cross. Some are happy that their lobbying. is successful some are waiting eagerly to receive praises from the authorities on the other hand some are terrified by his death sentence they want to meet him and console him this lady veronica has dared to break from the crowd and wipe jesus's face She loves him. She has received her gift. prayer Veronica was brave enough to lend a helping hand to you to wipe your face soaked in sweat and blood grant us the same courage that she gathered to break away from the clutches of unjust and cruel dictatorship of people and do what is right in serving others Let us not work to seek rewards but to serve others in all that we can. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. Holy Mother, pierce me through. In my heart each wound renew of my savior crucified. Then station Jesus falls a second time We adore you Christ and we bless you because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world As he makes his way along the narrow path to Calvary Jesus falls a second time He has hit the ground much harder this time 
सम सोल्जर्स मॉकिंग एट हिज लैक ऑफ स्ट्रेंथ ही इज एग्जॉस्टेड स्टिल वन आर्म एम्ब्रेस इज द क्रॉस prayer dear jesus many a times i find it hard to believe in myself when i fail i become impatient and give in to misdeeds help me to remain focused in those times when i feel powerless and vulnerable give me the strength to trust in you and rest in you when i feel sad empty and confused Help me believe that everything is possible in your love. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. Holy Mother, pierce me through in my heart each wound renew of my savior crucified. station Jesus meets the women of Jerusalem We adore you O Christ and we bless you because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world Meeting him is perhaps the least that these women could have done to console Jesus They too have broken down and by doing this they are partaking in his pain Jesus surely has a heart of gold he asks them to not weep for him but for their children and families he is such a selfless man prayer Lord these women accompany you on your journey to Calvary they share your pain and weep for you whenever we come across our neighbors in pain and suffering help us to partake in their sufferings and lend them a helping hand help us to share their burdens and console them when they 
are in distress. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. Holy Mother, pierce me through. In my heart, each wound renew. Of my Savior crucified. Ninth stage Jesus falls a third time We adore you O Christ and we bless you because by a holy cross you have redeemed the world The cross slips from Simon's hands and falls heavily on Jesus Half naked he lies helpless on the ground A cruel pleasure gleams in the eyes of the soldiers. He has arrived, but alas, at the cost of his last strength. Prayer. Loving Jesus, help me think of the cross you carried. Help me to be attentive to your voice and receptive to your guidance. Forgive me for the times when I have become so self-consumed that I lose the desire to change and grow. Help me believe that I can have the strength to get up as well. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. Holy Mother, pierce me through. In my heart, each wound renew. Of my Savior, crucified. Tenth station, Jesus is stripped off his garments. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. This is not watchable. This is so shameful for him. He went on preaching God's message, and now his image is torn down with his clothes. No inch of his body is without a wound. They haven't even spared him his undergarments. Utter humiliation, utter shame, and for no fault of his. We are responsible for stripping off his clothes.
Lord Jesus, they stripped you of your garments. You went through so much just because of us. Sometimes we forget the sacrifices you made for us and give in to sin and evil ways. Help us, Lord, to remember all the things you did just for us and our well-being. Give us the grace to conquer sin. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. Holy Mother, pierce me through. In my heart each wound renew of my Savior crucified. Eleventh Station Jesus is Nailed to the Cross We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you, because by a holy cross you have redeemed the world. He is stretched out on the same cross he carried so far. His hands and feet are tucked towards the beam of the cross. The soldiers take big nails and drive them into his hands. They are fastening his feet with huge wide nails. With heavy blows, they flatten those feet under the nails. His whole body is ragged. Mocking, they stand around him and challenge him to free himself. Now that he has been nailed. Prayer Dearest Jesus, I know that you did not succumb to being nailed to the cross. I know that you willed it for my salvation. No one took your life from you. It was yours and you gave it freely. I am sorry for the times I have turned away from you. Help me, Lord. To look again at the people around me. Help me see the hurt and pain I've caused in others. Be with me to help me make amends for the harm I have done. Have mercy on us, O Lord, have mercy on us. Holy Mother, pierce me through, in my heart each wound renew of my Saviour crucified.
12th station Jesus dies on the cross We adore you O Christ and we bless you because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world as his soul is leaving his body the sky is becoming darker and the nature is becoming aggressive his mother and all who love him are in immense pain he has accepted this death on behalf of sinners those sinners who might not even acknowledge him this is their greatest sin his agony cannot be compared and his sacrifice is the greatest it is difficult to believe that the son of god is dead Prayer Lord Jesus you finally did it you died for us we sinners seldom realize what a great sacrifice you made for us help us to sacrifice in all the small and least ways we can to sacrifice our time money and other resources for others May this sacrifice of yours always be remembered in our hearts and may it inspire us to do greater things for your glory and of our Father in heaven. Have mercy on us, O Lord, have mercy on us. Holy Mother, pierce me through in my heart each wound renew. of my savior crucified Thirteen station. Jesus is taken down from the cross. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. It is finished. Death has put an end to bodily suffering. Now they have come to carefully take him down from the tree of shame. to which he was nailed the lifeless body of jesus has been now given to his mother
prayer loving jesus give us the fidelity and courage to withstand moments of confusion a love ready to embrace you just like your mother who once more holds you close to her help us to look beyond all our prejudice and to offer you our hearts to be able to see how you have loved us Have mercy on us O Lord have mercy on us Holy Mother pierce me through in my heart each wound renew of my savior crucified Fourteen station Jesus is laid in the tomb We adore you O Christ and we bless you because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world A king is always laid in a special tomb He has all the arrangements made His favorite food jewelry and everything that was dear to him while he is alive Jesus did not have a tomb but thanks to Joseph from Arimathea he arranged for a tomb what a death god's own son Prayer Jesus you were born in a humble manger and your body didn't even have a tomb to be laid in Being the son of the most high you deserved so much better than you were granted You still accepted it with open arms Help us to be humble in speaking and living Let our only concern in life be to do the Father's will with you as an inspiration. Amen. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. Holy Mother, pierce me through in my heart each wound renew of my Savior crucified. Let us pray. Dear Mr. Jesus, we thank you for offering us a share in your suffering. With this way of the cross, help us to embrace and trust our Father's will as you did. When we are weary and exhausted with our own cross, give us the courage and strength to persevere so that we bring glory to your name. Amen. Let us pray for the intentions of our Holy Father. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, the world without end. Amen. The Lord be with you. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Go in the peace of Christ. My dear friends, I'd like to take this occasion to thank our youth of our parish who put this way of the cross together. They've scripted it themselves, they got it checked and rechecked, and finally did recordings in various other places in their own homes and collected everything together and have uh, brought an entire unified Via the Cross for all of us. I'd like to thank them for their effort and for helping all of us this morning to contemplate the mystery of Christ's sufferings, for having led us into prayer and for really showing that they are so committed to take up the responsibility and do it to completion. So thank you my dear, my dear young friends for this initiative and for helping us to pray. We now look forward to our Good Friday service of the Passion and the Veneration of the Cross. We will have that in the afternoon at 3 o'clock. So let's stay tuned for the service and partake of the Good Friday service. Thank you very much and God bless you.